Yo guys, and welcome back to some more Let's Play Mega Man Star Force 2. Now, the only reason we're in the Bermuda Maze is because, well, we're going to need to come here regardless to start the next scenario in the story. So basically, once you've beaten the game and load your save file up, you'll be right in front of the last area where you can save before going to fight Lemu. And then you'll get an email. Basically, the email is called a present from... we don't know. I have a special present for you, ha ha ha. You'll need to go to Lady Vega's hideout. Your present is there. Lady Vega's hideout is mobile and normally impossible to find. But just this once, I'll tell you where it is. At the moment, it is deep inside the Bermuda maze. Hehehe. <laughs> I've gone to all this trouble to tell you where it is, so be sure to get your present. So basically, yep, you guessed it, we need to take the long, slow route to get back to Lady Vega's hideout. Oh yeah, and you guys have probably noticed, I do have a lot more health and I have a lot more zenny. And I'm sure someone's going to say, oh, well, you used the code to get that zenny, didn't you? Surprisingly, no, I didn't. That's the sad part. Basically, I had to go and grind for... A bunch of standard and mega cards. The mega cards were easy, just you know, find all of the bosses and do that, fight them multiple times. Oh yeah, for those of you who think Pat's not in the game, he is actually in the game. He doesn't have any relevance whatsoever. It's just in the Was Up Ruins, you can find him, and he basically asks you if you can help him tame um, Ray by fighting him. But other than that, that's literally all it is. Oh, I need help fighting Ray. Can you help me tame him? I think I can doing this. Sure. Fight him three times and it's like, oh, okay, you're done. But yeah, it's like, fought everyone aside from, well, there's two left. It's just they're both in the next place. And then I have all 103 standard cards in the main game. Everything else that I don't have are things you can only get through the alternate world and such. Uh, it took forever to get some of those cards. You know how annoying it was. And yes, I did try actually just putting in a code to get all the cards, and it gives you all the cards, but when you save and check the menu, the game doesn't register it as, you know, being in there, so... It was kind of a Star Force 1 scenario again where... It was kind of moot. The only difference with why I actually grinded for these ones is because, well, Star Force 1, there really isn't any need to do the post-game content, nothing special about it. Star Force 2, though, yeah, it'd be silly not to do it. Whoa! What'd I just do? Oh, shit. I just screwed something up. Oh, no, 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 I see what I did. Oh, my bad. My bad. I was looking at the wrong place. I was like, wait, where am I going? I went to the special area. <coughs> but, uh, this is gonna be so much fun, because I've got to grind for so many more chips! At least it's not a whole lot after this now. Ooh, is that slow down? Or is that just me letting go of the controller, sort of? track of where I was. Okay, no, I found myself. These are the joys of talking and trying to look at a very scrunched up map. Yeah, I the only reason I'm doing this part is because I figured someone might want to know how to get back here again without having to go and search through one of the older videos to find which one it was. Ooh, a... Plasma Gun 3. Oh. Oh, wait, do I have three of them in here? Oh, yeah, by the way, if you want to fight Hollow to get his cards, Hollow's actually over there, in that corner. I mean, his EX form will be visible, it's just everything after that is... Okay, 
let's do that. <clears throat> Mega Man got alternate future. Bamboo blinds. Is this you? Is this used to hide the face of an important figure? Oh yeah. Hmm. What's this? If I remember. Damn it. Die, you punks. Oh yeah, we're getting some slow down. I hear the hiccups. I forgot they attack multiple times. Oh well. And I should have just shot it. Saved a few seconds. Would have saved a few seconds. Oh yeah, that was an obnoxious chip to find for some reason. Because every time I was trying to find one of them, they always came by themselves. And it would never give me the chip even when I S-ranked it. And it pissed me off. Oh yeah, those indie frags, they're not important to the story, by the way. They're just a thing where if you get all six or eight of them... You can do, you can like get a brother band thing where you can ch noise, not noise form, but kind of change into, what's his face, like a rogue form. And it's good, but at the same time, it honestly kind of sucks. I don't like it. One thing I definitely don't like about it is it like cancels a lot of your chips out. So you'll do something and... Then it just cancels everything else out. Let's close that. There we go. Okay. I'm afraid of you actually killing him, so... Although, personally, it doesn't matter too much, since I'm not using anything else. Here we go. Yeah, and once you get that alternate future thing, come back to the satellite dish, and this will happen. What the? My body's glowing! Yo, be careful, kid! I sense a powerful EM wave nearby! Whoa! The globe we picked up! Ugh! Body's on fire! Hey! This ain't your ordinary ball, kid! Look! A warp hole! Who's there? <laughs> Thank you. You have now opened a connection to the parallel world. Everything is going according to the script. Hey, kid! That voice is coming from the warp hole! Let's bust it up! <laughs> Your role in this little drama is finished. The world belongs to us now. What do you want? What are you gonna do? I will see you later. <laughs> He's gone. What the heck is a parallel world? Hey, kid! I felt a pretty powerful frequency just now. It's on the other side of the warp hole. So let's go after it! Bada -bum 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 -bum. I will say, when I was grinding for all those cards though, I did use A code. What was that? No random battles. Aside from when I was in areas where I was actively looking for them, you don't know how much... Oh, that made things so much nicer. It really made things nice being able to travel around without having to get into a battle every five steps. If I remember, we actually have to fight some of the moment we pop in. So I should have saved, but if I remember, it's a really easy one. Huh? Are we back in Echo Ridge? Something's wrong here. Help me! What's wrong? It's Taurus Fire! Taurus Fire? Where? 
Whoa! Uh, following one hurts leads me to an even tastier looking morsel. Bud, what are you doing here? Bud, who are you? Careful, kid. <coughs> I'm not picking up Bud's signature in there. That's not Bud. Enough blah 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 from you two. I'm hungry. Here he comes. Oh yeah, this is gonna be one of the fun parts about this world. We get to fight all of the, pretty much all of the bosses again, but in their IF forms, which means they're a lot faster, a lot stronger, a little scarier. And I didn't edit my folder at all, still. Oh, shit. Oh, this is gonna be good. <clears throat> Actually... Really? And this is the bad thing about using... The mix mash of cards. I don't know why I dodged. I was in invisible. Wow. Oh yeah, I gotta remember I can't get... Oh, just walking into him, bump... Oh, okay, that's good to know. I forgot about that. Yeah, I'm not used to Taurus Fire at all. Can you just do this? Kind of. Taurus Fire was the first one I took out, though, so... Not really fair to say that, you know, I gave him time. terrible run, but I don't really care. You don't get cards from them, so... I'm sorry, Great Apollo Flame! Ah. <coughs> that wasn't Bud? Hey, look up in the sky! The sky? Whoa! I don't think we're in Echo Ridge anymore, Mega! I don't think we're in Kansas anymore, Toto! Whatever the hell that dog's name is. Hey you! Is this place Echo Ridge? Why yes, of course it is! Apollo Flame destroyed this place only a few months ago! Destroyed? Hold up! No one told me anything about this place getting destroyed! Me either! <coughs> How did that happen? Was it really destroyed? You don't know. The weapon of Moo was responsible. What the heck's going on here, kid? That voice we heard in Echo Ridge. It said something about a parallel world. Parallel world. I get it now. Mega, I know where we are. It's a parallel world. It's not our world. This is an alternate future where humans lost their link power, so they couldn't avoid the precursor to ruin! An alternate future? I'm not really sure how this could happen, but there's one thing I do know. <gasps> Excuse me. Something powerful destroyed everything in this world, and somehow it's connected to our world. So this powerful thing is gonna try to break into our world? Probably. This is my fault. If only I hadn't picked up that thing. Hey, you! Yes? Didn't you say something about Apollo Flame? Yes, the Ann body that was born of Moo. <coughs> He's sleeping somewhere to recharge his energy reserves. 
This could be the chance we need. Yeah. We'll find him and take him out before he wakes up. That's not a good EM wave. I don't think Apollo Flame is gonna make this easy for us. We gotta hurry, kid. There's a place in Echo Ridge that connects to Apollo Flame. Thanks. You'd better go hide somewhere. Roger. Oh, what's your name? I'm Mega Man. Oh yeah, my uh, brother, <laughs> my link power is a bit high. Basically I used the thing so I could get something from one of those uh, navvies or whatever that wants you to have so much link power. It was like, I didn't feel like doing the request yet. But uh, the link power didn't go back down. Only Sonya's changed when I did her request to get the recovery 300. Which is actually, by the way, the only way you can get Recovery 300. You have to do Sonya's request. Which is make basically helping her write a song. Um, where do I need to go? But it's still got waves flowing through it. <clears throat> At least through this place we'll actually be able to get some... We'll be able to get the rest of the chips we need. Like here, pretty much. Wow, you would attack a lot faster. Bum, 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 bum. Why did I do that? Yeah, these things are a little intimidating. Yeah, screw it. Oh, that's right, that gets powered up because I'm ninja. I love that. I forget sometimes that everything gets powered up. I remember two of the Giga cards we're getting too are also gonna come through this place. There we go. Bye bye. No, three. The other three come through this place. One we buy, one we find, I think, and then one that you get after you. Beat this place. What do you have? Eh. Oh, come on. Oh yeah, that's another thing. The encounter rate has been upped again in here, so yeah, don't be surprised that things are we're getting into random encounters a lot faster. That's another thing I don't like about this place, is just the fact that we're going to get into random encounters very often. Okay, well obviously there's only one way I can go. Apparently. Take out two of them. Oh wait, no, we'll take out one of them. Love that buster. Oh yeah, and it's faster and stronger too, by the way, because I found another weapon. Oh, let's see. Oh my god. <laughs> this is obnoxious! Oh my goodness. Oh, 
Oh, well, we're getting... Let's see, how many chips do we have now? We got two more new chips since we got in here. Oh. I guess we didn't have to do Sonya's request. That... Okay. Well, I guess if you want it early, you do Sonya's request. <clears throat> oh, that is a... Uh... Boy. Okay. Oh, yeah. We have Grand Wave 3s. I need to get rid of the Grand Wave in general, but, you know, if we're gonna have a Grand Wave, might as well have a better one. Jesus Christ! Holy crap, this is, uh, ridiculous. Oh no, thank god. I was about to say, I just killed the little guy! He's in the very front row, so he's safe. Oh, we got another new card. It's actually pretty strong, so it'd, it'd be 230 damage after... Whatchamacallit. Oh, you're a wide sword, okay. I keep forgetting I can just press up and X. It's like I know to do it half the time, but... Holy shit. I forgot just how obnoxious these new encounter rates were. Okay, let's do that. As slow as it is, at least I get to get a little bit of health back and I can't use Demon Flurry on him, so... What? Um... I'm obviously... Uh, this random encounter rate is obnoxious. Well, that was a... Wow, I forgot about that. God, that hurt. Okay, I think we're just gonna end this episode off so we can find out. So I can find out where we need to go first. Oh, well, boy. We're getting most of our new chips through here already. Oh, yeah. My, uh, Zenny's already maxed out again. <laughs> I'm not... I li That's... That's actually how I got all of these things. I got... I ended up maxing out my Zenny, and then I just started buying all of them, and, well... It went up pretty quickly. Believe me, when you're grinding for chips in this game, you're gonna run into Zenny pretty easily. Okay, but anyways, we're going to end this episode off. I'm going to find out where I need to go really quick, and then we'll be back with some more Let's Play Mega Man Star Force 2. So, hope you guys enjoyed today's episode, and I'll see you all next time.